So today I'm coming at you guys with a Diwali makeup look uh, tutorial. So hope you like this tutorial. What are you waiting for? Go, 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 go watch the video. primed and moisturized my skin um, now I'm gonna put some um, <clears throat> screen so I'm using my Vichy sunscreen which has SPF 50 in it so I'm gonna put that all over my face so for my foundation I'm gonna be mixing two of my two of my favorite drugstore foundations so one is the cover Covergirl Ultra Stay Fabulous Foundation and the other one is the Revlon Youth Fix Fill and Blur Foundation. So I'm gonna mix that two together. I'm gonna take my beauty, I picked the foundation in my beauty blender and I'm gonna apply that all over my face. So for concealer, I'm using my MAC concealer and I'm in the shade NC42. So I had been using this um, primer for the last four years and I, I love this primer. I mean, concealer. So I'm putting that underneath my eye. Bridge of my nose. My cupid's bow and up in my forehead where I want to conceal and highlight my face. Now I'm going to take my setting powder for setting my uh, my highlighted area. I'm using the Artico setting powder. I'm taking a little bit of that on a brush and applying that on the area under my eyes, forehead, and my nose, and chin, where I highlighted. Bronzer, I'm going in with my Hula bronzer, and I'm gonna be bronzing all the areas that I just contoured. done my eyebrows I have an eyebrow tutorial in my channel so if you guys are interested in watching my eyebrow tutorial then I'm gonna leave that in the description below or towards the and towards the end of the video so that you can go ahead and click it and see how I do my eyebrows it's pretty simple go check it out um, okay so moving on to the eyes so I have already primed and prepped my eyes so for the first base shade I'm gonna take the uh, protego palette the shade um, which is in the beige color which is right over there so i'm gonna take that shade in a flat brush and then packing on to my eyelids like so So uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a tape towards the outer corner of my eye so that we get a very defined eye look. So now I'm going in with the Hula bronzer that we used before. I'm taking that in a smudging brush and then I'm defining my first base layer for my crease. So it is very important that you take the lightest shade ever that you can put in the crease and then build it up uh, for more of an intense um, depth look. So that's what I'm doing here um, using a wiper motion and putting it on towards the um, crease of my eyes. Now to more intensify it, I am going to be taking the brown shade from the Protego uh, palette from Tarte and I'm packing that into the crease area and defining it even more good so now i'm gonna go with the burgundy shade out there which is called stila and i'm taking that in a in the same smudging brush um sorry in the same um crease brush and i'm putting that all over 
uh, my crease and also I am defining my outer V. Now I'm going to go with this gold shade right here and this is from Maybelline palette and I'm packing that onto my eyelid so I am concentrating this shade more towards the um, center part of the lid moving towards the um, outer V area because I want to put a different shade towards the inner corner of my eye so I'm taking a um, flat brush and blending that all over my um, outer third of the outer third of my eye which is uh, more towards the crease area now I'm taking this jewels palette from um, cover girl and I'm taking that blue shade over there in a um, flat brush and I am defining my crease area even more um, to give a little bit of blue tint um, to my eyeshadow look so I'm here I'm defining my outer V because I want that blue shade more towards my outer V area so I'm taking this flat brush right here it's so 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 good to work with this brush so if you want a more defined outer V look so I'm taking the golden shade sorry sorry <laughs> um, I'm taking the uh, rose gold shade from the Maybelline palette and I'm packing that to the inner corner of my eye So I'm going to take the tape off I'm going to go with the blue shade one more time and creating a flick with my blue shade So now it's time for the lower lashes so for the lash line for the lower lash line I'm gonna go with uh, the dark brown color from the Tarte Pro to go palette and I'm gonna take that in a dense brush and put that onto my lower lashes lash line so it's very important that you start with a lighter shade and then build all the way to the um, to the darker shade to the lower lash line as well so I'm, I'm doing that here so as soon as this is done I'm gonna go back and put my lashes on and I'll be right back for the lip color today, I'm going to go with a L'Oreal uh, liquid lipstick in the shade Cowboy and I'm going to put that on top of my lips. Okay, so on top of it, I am going to go with the Artistry um, lip gloss in the shade Champagne. And this is a fancy, dancy um, lip gloss, you guys. Did you see that light coming through? So I'm going to put a little bit of that on top of my lips. So for blusher, I am going to go with MAC blusher. And this is in the shade Malibu. And for my for my highlighter, I am using Maybelline Master Chrome Highlighter. So to finish to finish off this look, I am gonna take my next Dewy Finish Setting Spray and spray it all in and go with my beauty blender on top of it. 